Hey what's going on guys, Ravi here from Ira FX and I welcome you to another After Effects tutorial. So let us first have a look at what we're going to be creating today. So we'll be making this slight text animation and it's a very beginner's tutorial. In fact, you can actually create a logo reveal as well with this effect. So how it's going to look like. Yep, so without any delay, let's get started. So let us first create a new composition. Click on composition, composition, and I name this to slide reveal. And I set this to 1920 1080p resolution with 30 frames per, per second and with 3 seconds duration and click OK. So let us first create a new solid that we'll be using as a background. I am okay with this green color. Let me name this background okay so click on this T button here so that you create a new text layer I'll name this to I'll type in slide animation and the next thing that I'll, I'll be doing is create a new shape layer alright so I'll make a shape a rectangle shape just like this and go to the first frame of your composition select your text layer click on P on your keyboard so that you can see the position uh, parameters click on this um, timer icon so that a keyframe is created and move this bottom just below the shape layer and move to around two and a half seconds forward and move your text layer back to top as that it moves above the shape layer just like the way you see in the the composition here so now select both these keyframes here holding shift on your keyboard right click and from keyframe assistant click easy ease the last thing that we'll have to do is ensure that the position parameter is selected and click on this graph editor button here so now you can see that we have a graph here if you are not able to see this right click here and ensure that edit speed graph is selected so click on right side end and move this to the left like this so that you graph is like this and when you start playing this this is how our animation lights in so the last thing that we have to do is change the track mat of our text layer to alpha inverted mat so if you're not able to see these settings here right click here and from columns make sure that modes is enabled Ch once when you change this to alpha inverted see that our text layer slides in like this so as told you earlier you can actually do the same thing with a logo as well just in case if you like to um, experiment you can download this project file from a website irafx.net absolutely free so if you are looking for more visual effects and tutorials consider subscribing to my channel and if you'd like to talk to me, you can connect with me on Instagram at VFXGuyRavi. See you guys next time with another tutorial.